am Brian Goulet of the Goulet Pen Company in Ink Nouveau, and I finally got just one too many emails <laughs> about the Banded Apple notebooks fitting into the Midori Passport Traveler's Notebook. So I decided, okay, I'm just going to finally shoot a video on this thing. So uh, basically, there's uh, the Midori Traveler's Notebook comes in two sizes. It comes in the larger, I guess, taller regular size and the smaller Passport. Now, in the regular size, you can use the Banded Apple Handy Notebook in there, and it fits perfectly. It's the exact same size as the Midori, but the Peewee is just a little bit larger, um, you know, taller, longer, whatever you want to call it, than the Midori one. And a lot of people ask me, you know, does that make a difference? How big of a deal is that? So here's the Midori one, okay? So that's how it fits in there. It's got a little bit of a, a border here where you can kind of see the leather behind it. And when you close it, you can't see it at all. It's completely enclosed by the leather. So if you're gonna replace this with the Banded Apple Peewee, you're gonna have to overstretch the elastic by just a little bit, but it will fit in there. And the compromise you're gonna have is you're gonna be able to see the notebook sticking out a little bit on the top, a little bit on the bottom, maybe about a quarter inch or so. Um, it's about the same width, so that's not really a problem here on the edge. It's really just the top and the bottom. And you're gonna need to decide whether that's a deal breaker for you or not. If you can live with that, then you've actually got a lot of options for other notebooks that you could use in the, tr in the passport size traveler's notebook. Um, I got field notes. You know, if you're a big fan of field notes, these are about the exact same size as the uh, Banded Apple. Uh, this is one of their limited edition ones that's out right now, uh, but you know, any of them, they're all the same size, three and a half by five and a half. So if you tuck this thing away in there, you'll see it sticks out a little bit on the top and the bottom. Uh, this one's got rounded corners, so that's actually, actually kind of nice. And then uh, width-wise, it's, it's fine. It'll fit right in that leather. So Field Notes is an option for you if you can live with that overhang on the top and bottom. Uh, I've also got the Clairefontaine Life Unplugged Staple Bound Duo. Um, this, granted, this is a two pack, but it's the exact same size as the Field Notes. So, again, it's going to stick out just a little bit on the top and the bottom. Uh, and it looks like it's sticking out a little bit more here because I've got two of them in there, but it's going to be the same as the Field Notes one. I've also got uh, Clairefontaine has one notebook that's in this size. It's their 63596 product code. Uh, it only comes in lined, but it's got a good number of pages in it. So a single notebook can get you a decent number of pages. It's got rounded corners, that's kind of cool. And plus, you know, if you like that slick Clairefontaine paper, there you go. So it's got a little bit sticking out on the top and the bottom. It's fine on this edge here. So that's an option for you. Uh, so why would you want to use the Banded Apple instead of the Midori? Uh, basically, there's a couple of, of benefits to it. Number one is that you get a couple more pages. Um, it is a little bit larger, so you get a little more writing space if that matters to you per page. Uh, and it's a little bit cheaper. You know, you're looking $4.20 for uh, Midori refill and $3.50 for a Banded Apple. So save a few few cents there. Um, however, the Midori, I actually like the paper just a little bit better. They're fairly comparable, uh, but I find that it performs just a little more to my liking. It's a little bit slicker. Uh, also, these pages are perforated in the Midori. So that's kind of nice being able to tear those out. Uh, plus, of course, you know, it actually fits in the thing properly. But anyway, now you have this information, you can use it for whatever you want to do and decide which one is best for you. So I hope you like that. If you have any other questions, you can always uh, leave a comment on Ink Nouveau on the blog or you can leave a comment in YouTube. Thanks so much for watching and right on.